Here we are. There's Jeff back there. Here's Carlton coming up. And we are hiking through what I'm going to now call Dope. Bovine Canyon. Remember? Bovine Ow. Canyon. God. Ah, ah. I just kicked a sharp log. <coughs> I wasn't even looking. My fault. Remember the rotting cow carcass? I know. Hey, Jeff. Yeah. I'm going to name this canyon today. Bovine Canyon. Bovine Canyon. Ooh. I mean, no, no, no. No, Bovine Graveyard. What's a bovine? Cow? Cow. Bovine is a yeah. yeah. Bovine is a cow. Just wait till he gets up here. Huh? Yeah, the carcass is still going to be decaying. I, fig I figured this out. I now know. I now know why all these bones are here all the time. It's because this isn't their land, but they treat it like their land still, and they bring all their sick they dead cows us. up here. If they caught us, they haul us sick infants. If they caught us, what? If they haul us sick infants, giving us stuff to wear with their robes, haul us sick infants. I don't know about that. This is not a place you want to bring bones. Well, that's not, that's not up to you. I'm going to show Carlton some, some, um, chanterelle. There he is. Oh, yeah. Chanterelle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shoot, I've been bushwhacking here. Coming down. Some extreme. Now, look at this. Wow. This is a tree that's been uprooted. We'll find out what it is on the other side if I get down there. That's an oak tree, I think. It's a big tree. Big tree. I can hear the creek. Jeff and Carlton are over on the left side of this ridge and I'm on this side. We're going to meet up at the bottom. Isn't that crazy? Upper Coon Creek. I came down from up there, I kid you not. But over there. Carlton and Jeff are off to the left. And we have to get back somehow. I think rest in pieces over there. I think I missed it a little bit. I probably could get over let's see if I can get over there uh, this is rest in peace right there I don't know if you can see that little bit of white part right there that's the sign it's falling off the tree and from what I can gather right over there you can see that old box right there and i think that's where they put the ashes i'm pretty sure gene santos rest in peace this is what we call rest in peace now you can see just how freaking steep it is over there i mean this is eye level here right Okay, up, 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 up. Try to climb that. Without ropes and all that, you know? Just try to climb up there with regular hiking stuff. Yeah. Not going to do it. Jeff and Carlton are still that way. I found a Seanorell, but I couldn't. I got my foot wet trying to cross this creek here. Because there's a place right here, you can't get around here. Maybe if I threw a bunch of rocks in, they could get through. But there's not enough rocks here. There's a pretty deep section there. Now i got to find my way back. And I think uh, 
I think that ivy over there is the way back. We're going to go to beer can camp and then wait for them. Unless if they show up right now. Take a little break here. Pretty severe bushwhack today. I've had to climb up around on both sides. Got my feet wet. Those rocks down there are super slippery. Too slippery for a 59 year old out by himself. So waterfalls, a series of them, right around the corner from Beer Can Camp. This is still on the Dutra property. And this is where the creek wraps around, does a little, like I'm standing on like a peninsula. And then the creek goes that way again. <clears throat> and then Beer Can is off there. But after that uh, deadfall you see across the creek, it's about 688 feet away, exactly, or oh, roundabout. Okay, you see this stuff here, this vine growing up here like this? This stuff is actually, it kind of ruins the plant that it's, that's hosting it. And uh, I'll show you what I mean. See, it wraps itself so tightly that it chokes the life. The more I peel away of this, the more you'll see of the deep indentations. You see that? So this is like um, nature harming nature because the plant that this is on needs to be able to uh, Sorry, I just, I thought I heard. Huh, maybe it's my backpack rubbing up against bush behind me. Anyway, all right, well, that's all I wanted to say. I'll probably cut that one out. Well, this is what I'm looking at. And uh beer can is over there. Here we are having our lunch here, or we just ended our lunch actually. And uh, we're at Beer Can Camp. This this tarp here is a tarp left at Beer Can. And uh, the Chanterelle Grove is over there. And they're going to go back over there and go do some more scrutiny and try to find some more. And uh, we're going to be going back to civilization up that way. Okay, Carlton's going to pick a chanterelle here. That's a big one. Yeah, it is big. But is it good? Yeah, parts of it are good. Parts of it are really good. Parts of it? another one right here, a little mini one. It's actually going all the way in. There's more growing in there. Yeah. For some reason or other, they just love this bush poison oak. I mean, really, it's just like, it's like, oh, this is where we want to live. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. We like this big one. Let's see. This, this is not a little one, but yeah, some of it's okay. Uh, these are good, I think. This one's pretty yeah, this good. One just, she wants just to do this one. Yeah, let's try that one. Uh, well, okay, it's found another one. Carlton's gonna get it. Oh, wow. it's a pretty big one too. Oh, this one's actually a good one. Yeah, that does look oh, good. Oh, this one's a really good one. There's yeah. Like a little forest here. Oh, wow. Yeah, and there's one right here too. But I don't know if this is any good, but it's probably not good. No. Oh yeah. To your to your right. Yeah. You're right. 
Yeah. Yeah, they're a little old. Oh, here's one right here. Maybe that's a good one. Yeah, I'll get this one. I don't eat these folks, but they are fun to find. I don't know, you tell me. Uh, Probably not good. Whoops! Nah, it's a little bit old. I mean, you could eat it, but it's just not fun. We tried to miss, I think, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, a couple weeks ago. Pretty cool. That's the way back down through there. It's uh, on the old Coon Creek Road. Doesn't look like a road though. All right, now we're on the good section of the old antique, not used anymore, Coon Creek Road. retaining wall and there used to be a, a cabin here and uh, you see where the fireplace hearth is that's that was the ground floor and there's a, a rail over here uh, left over handrail about that huh old 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 this is uh that was put in like over a hundred years ago and then here's some old model t parts and there's a Model T up here, the bathtub there, and then, and then here's the Model T. Oh wow! Looks like. I think somebody's actually been here. Look at that. Gee, I wonder if the gas is still good in there. <laughs> and here's the old motor. It's got a big old hole in it. So it must have thrown a rod. And there's part of the body up there and uh, there's some other things that are kind of strewn in there as well but this is an old old cabin site I thought you guys were right behind me And then here, there's two redwood trees, and these are planted. Redwoods don't grow here, naturally. You 
we've been back going up that way pretty steep everything's steep out here going back even the route we're going on but the route we're going on is you can see the old road here it even shows like the plants don't grow very well uh, on both sides it's been packed in so hard over a hundred well this road was put in over a hundred years ago over a hundred years and uh, it was it stopped being used probably right in the 30s maybe 